Yo YouTube uh, just doing an update video. Uh, it ain't a feeding video like I said because uh, moss, the pet trucks couldn't get any rabbits in. So I've just been keeping everyone on rats because uh, you know it's better than nothing. Uh, yeah, if you look up there, replace the tubs with the really useful tubs with the clips and that. I've got one down here. I brought all four tubs, six heat mats. Uh, Got, if you look there, got a bulb guard and in blaze has got a bulb guard. All of that fly, uh, oh and uh, this. Two of these, uh, 70 quid. So it was all right, I got all these heat mats for when I get more, more snakes and stuff. Yeah, I've got, uh, I'm taking these, these three snakes here to my girlfriend's house because uh, they're like baby snakes sort of uh, so I need uh, more uh, more of an eye keeping on them like uh, I'm not I'm at my girlfriend's most of the time so just taking them there uh, yeah um, got got rid of the Kaidi swapped it for this it's a 11 foot Java reticulated python female that's why i swapped it because it's female uh, she's very nasty and she's in shed at the moment so i'll just grab the camera off this is just a zoom in oh, i can't get her out she's just crazy she strikes at everything that's her there she's deep in shed at the moment she's she looks well more yellow than that yeah that's just a viv yeah yeah And uh, I got this bottom viv uh, sorted out, and my yellow anaconda's in there now, isn't it? That's the 4B22. Uh, yeah, um, my jam peas are deep in shed as well. They, they all, uh, all my ticks are. So, these. Yeah, three, three jumbo rats. No, three giant rats uh, last week, and he's had one giant rat this week. So, really deep in shed. <sighs> Getting his weight on now. Very big, really big snake. Yeah, yeah he's proper blue eye. Yeah. It's a nice girth on him now. He's just he don't stop shedding either. I've he's uh, last time I measured him it was about three months ago and he was a uh, ten foot four inch. But I think he, he shed about four times since then. So I think he's gonna grow longer in length as well. I reckon it'll get to about uh, a good 11 foot. Gives him up there, I'm gonna get her out. Just, I need to trim her claws, get really sharp. Um, yeah, uh, I'll get a strike out. A, a giant rat as well. Yeah, I don't think he's getting any longer. It's because he's so old aged. He's just getting fatter now. So I think I'll put him onto like a, a rat every month or something, man. Because otherwise he'll get too fat. Because that's what that's what happens with old snakes. As soon as they stop growing, they just start getting fatter. So we're just having to start. Put him on a rat every month or something because he's fully grown. So and plus he don't move move that much. So he's just lazy. Yeah. Well, baby female jump. If you come down here. Hold on. 
Why am I making a video? Go ahead. YouTube. Hold on, give me a minute. Can I walk? No. Just sit there. Back on, yeah. Right, yeah, sorry about that. It's my little brother who's just asking. Uh, yeah. Fever jump. She's deep in shed as well. But she's... Because... Look how much... Uh, she's got. Sorry, man. I'm just... Little brother's being annoying. Right, uh... Yeah. She's growing a lot. I ain't fed her in two weeks and because I can't feed her this weekend because she's in shed and she just kept them biting the rat but not do nothing. So yeah, that's uh she's got loads of room in the tub like anyway. The two we're going in a the next uh, upgrade will be a four by two by two or just uh yeah something like that. Four foot anyway. Yeah, it's in this one. No. Yeah, it's in this one. This new one. The other, actually. Yeah. Uh, Mel Albino Berm. Brought him because I like uh, the Albino. I'd, I'd have preferred it if it was an Albino with a tick or something, but. That'll be no bear. I'm not. I'm not breeding him. He's just, just a nice looking animal. <coughs> yeah, he's, a, he's just shy of four foot years. He's, he's fairly slender because uh, he was hooked on mice. He was, and he wouldn't go onto rats. But I've got him onto rats now. He drop feeds, doesn't strike. He like. He looks interested as if he's gone to strike, but then he doesn't. So I just have to leave it in his tub. Yeah, that's him. He's a bit issy, but he's, he's very nice natured. Very active snake as well. There we go. That's him. And then... And then this is Sparkle. She is a Taiwanese beauty snake. I didn't say it in my last video, and no. I sent a, sent a guy asking what she was. But yeah, she's a Thai beauty snake. Right, from Taiwan. Yeah, she, she's on small rats. Very big now. If you've watched any of my old videos, you'll see I, I've had her since she was a hatchling. She's a CB12. Yeah, she's kept the colours. Kept the colours well. She never refused a meal. Even when she's in shed, she never refuses. That's good. Yeah, she's, she's nice natured as well. got a drawer then the other set of drawers broke so what I did I got a piece of wood there hold on a minute yeah you just got a piece of wood there going across and put a heat mat at the front didn't want it at the back just so I'd keep an eye on it like because uh, you can't really see it at the back but yeah I've got two tubs there that one's empty at the moment so I'll push that to the side and just got this one over the more of the heat mat. If I get it out, it's just uh, got my male corn snake in there. He yeah he started eating now. 
which is good. It was just because of breeding season, I'm guessing. So yeah, that's him. Uh, well, that's that's all of them. Hold on, let me just give you a quick view around. So there's the booth stack there. You got that up there. All that there. So it's all in one line, nice and smart. And you got them tubs under there. Alright, cheers guys, cheers for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe. Safe.